What's good, YouTube? This is Austin Sweet, the Gaming and Wrestling Titan, and I just want to go ahead and welcome everyone back to Top 10 Thursdays. That's right. This is Top 10 Thursdays, Episode 3. In today's episode, we are going to be covering one of my favorite country singers. This is Top 10 Thursdays, Top 10 Blake Shelton songs. My favorite Blake Shelton songs, for that matter. And don't worry, I've got a lot of favorite Blake Shelton songs, and I will be doing another one in the near future. So get ready for that. But for today, I just picked out 10 of my favorites. So let's go ahead and get started. So at number 10, we have Go Ahead and Break My Heart featuring Gwen Stefani off of their off of the album If I'm Honest. This song came out in 2016. Um, I have mixed emotions about this song. It's okay. It's basically about a breakup and relationships and stuff. It's just, ugh. But this song's okay. This song's okay. Uh, it's all right in my opinion. It's pretty good. At number nine, we have the Dreamer off of the off of Blake Shelton's album, The Dreamer. This song came out in two thousand three. Um, I think the song is really good. The lyrics make it like very sad. I don't know why, but this song overall is pretty good. I enjoy it. Go check it out if you haven't. Number eight is I Don't Care, not to be confused with the song by Apocalyptica. This is Blake Shelton's version of I Don't Care, which was released off of the album Pure BS. This song came out in 2007. Basically about relationship. Like, what the heck, man? But the song overall is really sad, in my opinion, but it's good, though. Um... So be sure you guys go check that out if you haven't. Number seven <clears throat> is Over off of Blake Shelton's album Red River Blue. The song came out in 2012. Um, it's about a man. He's trying to, he's doing everything to, to have this girl fall for him. I think overall it, it's a good song. It's definitely speaks out about it. The lyrics are, it makes it good. It what makes... A good song, a good song, especially that one. Number six is Gunna off of Blake Shelton's uh, next studio album, Bringing Back the Sunshine. This song was released in 2015. It's about innocent, carefree romance. And in my opinion, the lyrics work out for this song. The song is really good. Check it out if you haven't already. And the music for Gunna is very upbeat. I like it. Number five is Sangria off of the same album, Bringing Back the Sunshine. It was released the same year Gunna was. Now, Sangria, if you guys don't know what Sangria is, not the song, because we're going to discuss the song here in a minute. Sangria is basically a drink. It's basically, that's what it is. It's a drink. But this song, Sangria, is talking about making out. The song, the lyrics, makes it really good, but the music for it, is what makes it really interesting. And the music video is spot on too. Be sure you guys go check that out. Number four is Every Time I Hear That Song off of Blake Shelton's album, If I'm Honest. This song was released last year. Um, I thought overall the, al the song was really good. It makes it, the lyrics makes it good. The music makes it excellent. And the music video is what really makes this song shine. Check it out if you haven't already. That is an awesome song. Number three is I Lived It. Off, and this was off of Blake Shelton's recent studio album, Texoma Shore, which came out this year. The song came out this year. Um, basically, I Lived It is talking about Blake Shelton's past. Um, the song is good. The lyrics are good. The music is excellent. And the music video, is, like I said, really makes that video shine. Check out I Lived It if you haven't already. Number two is Austin, and it came off, and it was, it's off of Blake Shelton's first album entitled uh, Blake Shelton, which is self titled. The song came out in 2001. With this song being Blake Shelton's first number one, his first song, I think it was really good. The lyrics are, is what makes the song good. The music, and this is excellent. 
Makes you want to unwind and relax, but that song is really good. Number one on this list is my my favorite Blake Shelton song at number one is Old Red. It came off of the same album as Austin was, but the song came out in 2002. Um, the song's about a narrator who's in prison for 99 years, who's sentenced to 99 years in prison. Um, he tries to get out. He's taking care of a dog named Old Red, and he basically gets out of prison. He was heading north to Tennessee because they let Old Red, and he was going. He let they let out Old Red, and he was going south. Old Red was, but in my opinion, I think Old Red is the best Blake Shelton song I've heard. Um, the lyrics is what makes it good. The music makes it excellent, <coughs> and the music video makes the song stand out. Excellent. Go, so go check out Old Red if you haven't already. That is excellent. So those are all of my top. So those are all my Blake Shelton songs. My top ten Blake Shelton songs. And trust and believe, I am going to be doing another Top 10 Thursdays that has to do with Blake Shelton on down the road. But if you guys enjoyed this Top 10 Thursdays, be sure you smash the like button, comment down below, and subscribe. Uh, tap the bell, turn on all notifications so you know the next time I upload a video. Quick reminder about channel shoutouts. If you want your channel to get a shoutout, you have to put in the comments on this video, hashtag I want a shoutout. And I'll be sure to give you guys a shout out. I'll be sure to give a channel a shout out tomorrow in tomorrow's video. So get ready for that. The links to my social media will also be in the description. Facebook, Snapchat, and Instagram will be in the description as well. Click one of those links and I'll be sure to catch up with you there as well. Don't forget, like I said, if you want a channel shout out, you got to put your channel name in the comments. Also put the hashtag, I want a shout out. You have to do it on this video though. The first person to put the hashtag I want a shout out gets the shout out for tomorrow. <coughs> and coming up next Tuesday, I have a huge announcement regarding Trivia Tuesdays. So stay tuned for that, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the channel shout out video.